Okay guys, Hi. this is Felicia and I, wow, I didn't use a lot of this kit. I mean I did, but I should have used more. So I think I put too much in it, that's what I think. So I still have a lot of this um, stuff here. Um, I still got my favorite things here, these are the cork thickers that I like so much. And I still have these thickers and I still have some paper actually I did pretty good on the paper so um, I could have did better but you know I did pretty decent on it so I ended up with the inspiration piece that was our original thing I ended up still having that um, I could not find the photo that I wanted to put with this I had the perfect photo for this and for some reason I looked all over I'm probably going to find it, but I looked all over and I couldn't find the photo to go with this inf inspiration piece right here. So that's one of the reasons why I didn't use it because I really wanted to save it for that. So, and I still am because once I get that photo, find it, then I'll be able to, to, um, scrap it one of these days, just on a regular, um, basic. So anyway, so I have some photos here left over. And um, so I'm definitely not going to be scrapping them in this kit, but I will be scrapping these photos in the next kit. So that's coming up. So we'll just go ahead and put that to the side and stuff. So I still have the chipboard, lots of chipboard, lots of the sticker sheet left. Oh boy. <laughs> um, I didn't use the stencil in this one. And I think these are just packaging. Yeah, that's just packaging. Um, I th These are the leftover circles, which I am keeping because I, I don't have to worry about cutting perfect circles now. I just have some extra circles on hand. But um, these are the extra circles from the cut apart. The, I'm sorry, the, um, what do you call it there? The, the uh, oh my gosh, cut file. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Couldn't even remember that, but... So I'm going to keep those. And then I have a ton of die cuts left. And I'm going to definitely try my best to get these used. These are really nice, but they're hard to use. I'll tell you that much. And then I have my washi. So all my washi, of course, you never... I have yet to use a whole roll of washi. Oh, that would be a party in itself, I'll tell you. And then I have some wood veneers left. I got three of these. And I got some, these are just scraps. I don't need that stuff. These are just all scraps and that goes with that. And I still have quite a bit of the craft market pack here that I just dumped out here. This is all of the craft market except for this. This doesn't go with the craft market, so I'm gonna move that. But anyway, so, and then I still got the Tim Holtz ephemera pack here. There's a lot in these ephemera packs. Oh my gosh, these ephemera packs, I love them, but oh man, today I'm going to jump for joy when I can use up a whole pack, kind of like the washi. <laughs> And then these are all the extra brads too. So I'm just going to pull all this stuff out and get it ready for the kit here that I just did the video for. Oh my gosh, I can't even get this stuff up. Now you guys probably think I'm like super gooberish because I can't even pick this stuff up. <laughs> I don't have very long fingernails and the fingernails that I do have they end up breaking so why even try to keep them <laughs> yeah, sometimes I tell you I don't know how people grow long fingernails because I sure would like to grow long fingernails but anyway enough of the fingernail story <laughs> I am going to clear this all out completely so it can be empty and ready for the next kit which I already did the video for, and you've already saw it. I know I kind of did it backwards here, but it's okay. Uh, it's okay. And so now this is all cleared out. And I will be back in a second to have it all filled out. Filled up, I should say. <laughs> Alrighty. 
Okay, so now I am back. I got it all filled up here. I got my enamel dots, my 3x4 cards, my ephemera pack here, my wood veneer. Um, all just a different, I sorted it out, kind of put it in different areas. It's going to be pretty interesting to see how I use these things. I might decide to color them with some of the watercolor paints. Who knows? Huh? We'll figure it out. And then I like these little butterflies, these little thingies right here. And then these frames that I never used uh, around here, funny. And this star one. So I have an idea, actually. I think I'm going to go with it for that one. But this is all my big stuff. And I like to keep the packs I can know what I've used. And sometimes I don't cross it off, but I, I got a good memory for when it comes to these things. For some reason, I could tell, well, I didn't use that. I used that. I used that. I used that. So, but I keep these. And so I got my, my stamp set down here. My papers are underneath. Um, I have my thickers here and my freebie there. My four by, I'm sorry, six by six is over here. So I am all ready this time. I am a little bit more organized here. I don't like being unorganized, but anyway, that happens. And so I'm ready. All right, guys, so that's it. So I want to thank you guys for watching and taking time out of your day. And I know you could be doing other things, but um, I really thank you for watching. And I hope you enjoy the For the Love of Homemade Kits series with us all. Because um, we really love doing it with you guys, uh, for, for you guys. And um, I really um, appreciate all of the nice comments and the support and everything. And we all do. We all do. And we really love it. We talk about it from time to time and things like that. So... Anyway, uh, or how much we'd love to do it, that is. <laughs> the uh, For the Love of Homemade Kids series is just how it's just come a, a little ways here. I mean, we're on round six now. And so we're super excited and super happy. So thank you guys once again for watching. Take care. And bye-bye. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>